Hi, I'm Gino, biotechnologist and new media artist who is really into biohacking. Um, yeah. <laughs> Uh, to begin with, I would like to thank to the amazing producers and organizers of the MTF Festival for inviting me here to play a little bit with the topic of biohacking and the topic of just ocean here at MTF Labs. And all of the MTFers for the amazing brainstorming sessions and molting pot of the ideas. So, just ocean as a topic, uh, I feel it's like really important topic to be explored these days uh, by all of us so we could together learn and innovate uh, to come up with some solutions that we can use for the shared problematic of all of us as a society. Few of these like common problems, shared problems have been um, recognized by the UN and few of them include waters. Uh, I strongly believe in the um, uh, that we can use art-driven innovations as a methodology to achieve solution of these goals. Here at Aveiro, I have been fascinated by the Salinas, uh, like how diverse they are, and especially with the microorganisms that we could sense are thriving there. And we could sense this by the different colors of the lakes, different Salinas, and this is the topic I wanted to explore further here at MTF Labs. Uh, so, together with Marta, I set up an improvised biohacking bioart lab here in the corner by depleting a nearby Asian store for materials and supplies for improvised tools and reagents. Um, I believe that biotechnology is an important tool to be used to perceive the invisible, in particularly the microorganisms, bacteria that are the beginning and the end of the loop of life on Earth. Here you can see some of the experiments done here at MTF Labs. Uh, I made like simple uh, cultivation media that can be used, that can be made by common kitchen household chemicals and materials. So every one of you can uh, explore with the topic of microbiology, play with it at home to cultivate bacteria and yeast and other microorganisms. Here, uh, I did that with samples from the Salinas because I was interested uh, which microorganisms are found in these harsh environments. Whoever is interested in checking out the results, you can drop by to the lab after all of these like performances and presentations to check out what has grown. But uh, just like using visual representation, I don't, didn't feel it was enough, enough for this amazing scope of MTF. So I wanted to merge the topic of biotechnology with music. So how to do that? Uh, simply by making improvised organic ba uh, batteries, fuel cells that use the power of microbes to dissolve organic matter. And by doing so, they produce electrons or uh, electric current, which is weak but strong enough to be detected by a common sound card of a PC. So I made these batteries, hooked them up to the computer, and list, I've listened to the voices of the microorganisms that I would like to share with you now. Uh, sorry. So this is just a small sample. I have like a few hours of the recordings. So whoever wants to play with these recordings, I would be sharing them with you after.
Okay, so this is just a small sample <laughs> to show you how we can perceive microorganisms using sound. Actually, like the original sound that came out from the batteries was like uh, in really high frequency, so I had to slow it down so we are able to perceive all of this. Like this is the actually the footprint of a uh, billion biochemical processes that like this huge number of bacteria produce uh, in this experiment. So anyways, this is technology that all of you can experiment with in music for sampling, for creating something uh, new and innovating and uh, enabling citizens to use different senses to perceive uh, this ecosystem. Uh, this was not the only experiment done here. I also continued on, on experimenting with this technology by collaborating with Daniel, uh, hooking up these sounds from microbial fuel cells from these batteries uh, with his Internet of Things sensoring, uh, environmental sensoring systems, so uh, that you can use this interactive system to modulate and play with the sound of microorganisms and by doing so, co-create new composition. Uh, whoever wants to try the system out, um, we would be plugging it in after the presentation and performance. Okay, that would be it from me. Thank you so much. <laughs> Voila, Gino.